All right, thanks for watching. And today I want to evaluate another crazy integral, the integral of square root of x to the square root of x from zero to one. And actually I don't even need to do anything because I have done uh, the general case in another video. I just wanted to tell you how to adapt it to uh, um, calculate even this crazy thing. So in a previous video, I've shown that the integral from zero to one of x to the c, x to the alpha dx can be written as a nice series, sum from zero to infinity, c to the n minus one to the n, one plus x, one plus alpha n to the n plus one. And yeah, there are some restrictions. Alpha needs to be positive, c needs to be positive, otherwise uh, you might run into trouble. And in particular, notice this integral is of this form because it's the integral of the, from zero to one of x to the one half to the x to the one half dx, which is integral from zero to one of x to the one half x to the one half dx. In particular, c is one half and alpha is one half. So if you let, again, c equals alpha equals one half, then you get this beautiful result, the integral from zero to one of square root of x to the square root of x equals to the sum from n from zero to infinity of one half to the n minus one to the n, one plus n over two to the n plus one. And if you want, you can simplify this. So that's the sum from n from zero to infinity of minus one to the n over two to the n. And this one plus n over two, you write this as two plus n over two to the n plus one. And so you get, if you want, n plus two, or two plus n to the n plus one over two to the n plus one the two to the n's cancel out, and then you're just left with two times the sum from n from zero to infinity of minus one to the n over n plus two to the n plus one, which if you want to write as a series, that gives you two times, so zero, zero, so two to the one, I think, yeah, sorry, uh, two times, zero and then uh, two to the, yeah, two to the one and then minus one over three to the square. I was confused, I had it wrong in my notes, so that's wrong. And then plus one over, uh, so four to the third. And then I guess minus one over uh, five fourths, etc., etc. So another kind of beautiful series, you know, one half minus three squared plus one over four thirds minus one over five fourths, etc., etc., equals to that integral. So I think it's cute. I unfortunately I realized that after I made that video, uh, that's why I wanted to give it to you as an appendix. All right, I hope you like this quick math. If you want to see more math, please make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.